That's right. We have a nice stretch of dry weather ahead. This was the scene today from Jensen Beach, and I know a lot of folks probably headed to the beaches with the beautiful blue skies. And uh, now that it's 620, almost dark, but not quite yet. Right now it's 70 degrees in West Palm Beach. The dew point still at 42, so dew points in the 40. That's a very, very dry air mass for South Florida. We're one degree cooler than we were at the same time yesterday, and our winds out of the east at 7. So an easterly breeze warmer than the northerly breeze that we had earlier this weekend. Want to show you some first alert weather spotter photos. This is from Lee Potter, Juno Beach, uh, showing a moonrise there of the full snow moon. And then check out this beautiful sunrise taken by Ed Mullen, along with, he says this is Peggy the Pelican. So apparently Peggy has her own name and she hangs out on the Juno Beach Pier. And this is sent in from Michael Graham Lake Worth showing the beautiful blue skies and the beautiful blue waters too. So I hope you enjoyed today. Current temperature is still very comfortable outside. 66 in Jupiter, 70 West Palm Beach, 69 degrees in Boca Raton, 65 Sebastian, 65 Vero Beach, and 68 degrees right now in Okeechobee. Wind speeds generally less than 10 miles per hour and uh, generally we're seeing east to northeasterly winds and that's going to continue as we head into the work week. So that's why we're going to see a gradual warm up. Temperatures this evening staying mild right through midnight near the coast, right around 60 degrees. Clear skies, a beautiful evening. So here's the setup. High pressure continues to scoot a little further to the east. And as it does so, that will give us northeasterly winds and eventually east to northeast and eventually southeast throughout the week, work week. So that's what is going to warm us up to unseasonably warm temperatures close to 80 degrees by mid week. So mild and dry. That's the forecast for your Monday looking good. If you're hoping to get outside, maybe do some paddle boarding. Overall, it's looking pretty good. Wind speeds less than 10 miles per hour and temperatures warming up to 76 degrees by two o'clock in the afternoon. So sunny skies, light breeze on Monday, staying mild. Tuesday, Wednesday, looking great too. As you can see, Vipercast model, leave those umbrellas at the back of your closet because we are not expecting much rain until perhaps we get into Friday and only a 20% chance at that. So your high temperature trend, just soaring upward all the way to 80 degrees by Thursday, then a little dip for the weekend, but still near seasonal averages. Tonight, temperatures dropping down to about 56 degrees and a little bit cooler inland, but not too much. Tomorrow, 76, beautiful day. I know most of us have to work, but if you have the day off, enjoy it. And uh, for the boaters, the seas are subsiding, so better boating for Monday. Seas two to three feet, winds out of the east, northeast at 10 to 15. Inland waters, we will find a light chop and here's your seven day forecast. So looking really nice this week and I say we deserve it because it's been an interesting winter, but high pressure firmly in control, giving us sunshine temperatures in the upper seventies until we get to Thursday, 80 degrees. Now we are talking a few showers Friday, Saturday, perhaps a few storms by Sunday.